Hello everyone, welcome to Broadway Online Learning. This is teacher Mo. Today I'm going to teach about the topic, the art. Before we learn about the sentence structure, let's try to learn about the word first. Please repeat after me. Sing songs. Sing songs. Make movies. Make movies. Write stories. Write stories. Design clothes. Design clothes. Paint pictures. Paint pictures. Make models. Make models. Now let's look at the sentence structure. Uh, when does he or she like to do in his or her free time? Okay, so for example, we can say, what does she like to do in her free time, right? If we want to give an answer, we have to say, he likes to or she likes to, we can say like this. Okay, let's look at the dialogue. What does she like to do in her free time? She likes to make movies. Okay, let's look at this picture. What does she like to do in her free time? She likes to sing songs. Number two, what does she like to do in her free time? She likes to make movie. She likes to make movie. Number three, what does he like to do in his free time? He likes to write stories. He likes to write stories. Number four, what does she like to do in her free time? She likes to design clothes. She likes to design clothes. What does he like to do in his free time? He likes to write story. He likes to write stories. What does he like to do in his free time? He likes to make models. He likes to make models. Okay, let's look at another sentence stretcher. Another sentence stretcher is yes or no questions. If we want to ask a yes or no questions, we have to start with the auxiliary verb do or does. Okay, so here, does he or she likes to paint picture in his or her free time? Okay, so always remember that we use verb one after the after do we use for infinitive if we agree we can say yes he does or yes she does if it is a negative we can say no he doesn't or no she doesn't for example does she like to make models yes she does let's look at some examples does she like to sing songs in her free time Yes, she does. Does he like to paint pictures in his free times? No, he doesn't. Does he like to paint pictures in his free time? Yes, sh he does. Does she like to make models in her free time? No, she doesn't. Does he like to sing song in his free time? No, he doesn't. Does she like to write stories in her free time? Yes, she does. Okay, look at the summary. Now, if we want to ask the questions, what does he or she like to do in his or her free time? We can say, what does he or she like to do in his or her free time? If we want to answer, we can say, he likes to or she likes to. If we want to ask a yes or no question, start with the auxiliary does. If the subject is he and she, and then we can say, does he or she likes to paint pictures in his or her free time? If we agree with the questions, we can say, yes, he or she does. If we don't agree, we can say, no, he or she doesn't. Okay. Okay. So, for example, um, can you tell me about yourself? What do you like to do in your free time? Okay. For example, I like to 
paint pictures. I like to sing songs. I like to travel. Whatever you like. What do you want to do, or what do you like to do in your free time? Okay, so that's the end of our lesson. Thank you for watching. See you next time.